It's 86 degrees outside and I got a hoodie on like it ain't hot. Money, hold up, got a cut up, lot of order, order, dollars, quarters, wrist, water, reach, water, your bitch, on the, on the, on the, wanna, come on, come on, on the, hey, come on. Oh my goodness, we have not vlogged in the car in like so long, I feel like. I miss this. I miss just mounting the camera up and being able to talk to you guys as I drive. Currently, I am on my way to Ulta. I need to pick up some shampoo and conditioner. I picked up conditioner not too long ago from like Target. I think it was like, I know, not I think, but it was like one from Camille Rose and I have to say I wasn't crazy about it. It's not terrible conditioner. It just wasn't giving what I wanted it to give. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just stop being cheap and just go really buy some good shampoo and conditioner because I really need it. But I also need to declutter a lot of my products that I have back at home. So hopefully we'll get to that. I think I feel like we're going to be doing a lot of decluttering and cleaning out in this vlog because those are just the things that my mind is currently focused on but nonetheless I'm happy that we are vlogging in the car again y'all I got this like little gummy thing that holds the camera in place I don't need no mount or anything this is the mount that I was using before I lost it found it and then it just wasn't working out so we haven't been able to talk as I drive in a long time which probably is a good thing to be honest but anyway um, I'm blurry because my phone's in the way but we should be to where we need to be in like 15 minutes so i'll talk to you guys then i guess and we'll see what we end up getting from ulta you used to call me on my cell phone late night when you need my in 1000 feet use the right lane to turn right then I'll turn left. Y'all, they don't got nothing. They're pretty much out of everything. So what I was thinking was to just get this and then try this so that way I could try everything. The shampoo, the conditioner, there's a defining cream that I wanted to get anyways, and a leave-in. So maybe that's the smart thing to do. I also like the Don't Despair Repair line, but they only have the conditioner. They don't have any shampoo. This is just the deep conditioning mask. And then there's this, and this has the shampoo in it. It has a conditioner, conditioning mask, and something else, uh, treatment oil. Y'all, I am so, so happy that I was able to go into Ulta and not spend extra. Like I went in there with my mind made up on what I was getting, maybe not down to this product specifically, but I knew I wanted shampoo, conditioner, and specifically a, um, curl cream from Briogeo. So let me show you really quickly what I did pick up because I did show you guys they didn't have much and I was going to get the travel size of the curl line. They have the curl, they have the no frizz, they have the density, um, they have the repair line and then they also have like their superfood or whatever. And again, I was going to get the travel size of the curl line because I already knew I wanted the uh, Curl Charisma. So this is the Rice Amino Avocado Leave-In Defining Cream and it looks like this. So they do have a gel of this same kind of like line. I don't know what I don't know what to call it but they do have a gel. This is not a gel this is actually a cream which is something I prefer over gel because I don't I don't want gel like I don't want to continue to put gel in my hair for real. I mean, I might on occasion, but I want to find, obviously, a product that I could use in between blowouts when I don't want to put heat on my hair that I can just put in my hair and it, you know, does something good for it. But as far as like the shampoo and conditioner, I found what I was looking for, which is the repair one. This is the Don't Despair Repair Super Moisture Shampoo and Conditioner. So they look like this and they were on the end cap. If you guys know about the treatment mask, then this is that same line. I mean, where should I really even start? I got holes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my...
you good with them soft lips. Yeah, you know word of mouth. The square root of 69 is a sum, right? Cause I've been trying to work it out. Oh, go white wine. Uh, I come alive in the nighttime. Yeah, okay, away we go. Only thing we have on is the radio. Oh, let it play. All right, y'all. It is time that I declutter my stuff. I have so much stuff and honestly I've been wanting to like declutter everything for the longest time. We are in the bathroom currently. Remember that drawer I told you guys about a long time ago that was in here in the master bathroom that I needed to clean out? I hadn't touched it since I moved here. Well today is that day because we didn't touch it before. It's a hot mess. I kind of don't want to show y'all but I'm gonna show y'all but it's a hot mess so brace yourself. This is the drawer. Literally, I have a lot of crap in here. I got a hair straightener, hair tools, hair products. Um, what is this? Do rags. I just got brushes, products I don't even use. I got it all. So we have to clean this out today. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go product by product. I also have some stuff underneath my side of the sink too. And the idea is to take the products that I want to keep and put it in the other bathroom because that is where I basically do my hair stuff. This bathroom, I mostly do skincare in. And I was going to put the skincare in the other bathroom too. Maybe I'll have some stuff over there, but we're going to start with um, hair care, decluttering hair care, um, hair tools, all things hair related. This is like empty. I don't know why I'm holding on to this, but this deep shine from Rusk. I absolutely love this. This is perfect for like my blonde hair. There's another one from Rusk that I actually really, really like even more than this one. I just use this one because my hair has blonde in it, but there's another one that I like too. I need to repurchase that obviously. So that's going in the trash pile. This edge control is my holy grail. It's the only edge control that I feel like I've used that I actually really, really, really stand 10 toes down on and absolutely love. It doesn't leave like a white cast or anything on your hair. You can put it on one day, the next day comb it out and you won't gotta worry about it like flaking up or anything. This is from Amazon. This is the gummy hair styling wax. So since I do have product left, I know it didn't look like I did, but I do have product left, so I am gonna keep that. I do need to gather all my little barrettes because I can never find those. I do not use this. I don't know if my girlfriend does though. I feel like she does for her hair treatment that she does. So I will put this to the side for her. Walmart to pick up a few things. This I do not need, but it looks so good, so we're gonna try it. And then I got some other stuff in there too. Butter. All right, they didn't have the Italian style, but I'll eat this one. This is a Cajun. 